Hey guys, welcome back. This is another Hero Click video off the new set Notorious. Normally I buy a case of these normally, but this time I just bought a brick, which is 10 of these boosters. Not because I the set's not a good set or anything like that, just that with me doing a lot of other things, if I'm gonna buy something, I gotta be very more conscious of what instead of just buying willy-nilly but then again that's life so here we go here's one of the boosters on the side you have uh it's 81 figures this is like they're one of their biggest sets ever and this has like the the deceased storyline right here which is cool and they have you know basically this is the all villain wave all villains <clears throat> and plus I have my legacy card right here I am hoping for, there's one legacy card I'm hoping for and that's I'm on the hunt to get that legacy card hopefully this legacy card is what I'm doing and I'm not going to say what it is until after I get this done but one thing I always say about hero clicks is the fact that there's not a lot of villains. A lot of sets are just so. I mean, eight about eighty percent is like heroes and twenty percent like villains. And it's like uh, okay, so finally, a lot of us got our wish, and this is a DC villain set. So hopefully, Marvel will come up and do one as well. Depending on how long this set is. Okay, so let's see what do we got here. So here we go. We got a Manhunter, Gorilla Boss, White Rabbit Goon, not Mr. Freeze, but his name is Captain Cold, I'm sorry, and Black Mana in the Justice uh, Super Friends get up. Okay. Now, one thing that's cool is that they have these... Uh, mechanic called goons and that's a very unique gimmick so very very unique all right second one hopefully you guys are doing it hopefully hey, healthy you guys are having a good day yeah you know i this set came out about maybe close to i want to say three to f almost a month ago and I finally decided to buy it. At first, I wasn't going to buy this set. At first, I wasn't going to do it. But... I just decided that, you know... Why not? I'll just buy a brick... And then if I and then later on, if I feel like buying some more, I can either buy it as singles or I'll buy another brick later on. Baggy, so that means something's kind of cool. So first thing we got is a regular goon. Regular goon. Um, if you saw the Batman TV show with Adam West, they you know they, that's what he looks like. We got Mirror Master over here chilling. Joker Goon, Mr. Freeze, which is a character I wanted, which is cool, and we got a Quadrant, Quadrant, Quadrant Thunderer. Supposedly, those things are really cool, and the weird thing about it is that I have gotten double cards. All right. Yeah. 
You know, right, right now it's almost Halloween. And right now I'm thinking about my top figures of the year. And when I put that together, I can't wait to see what comes up of that. Okay, interesting, interesting. All right. We got Lex Luthor. Superman, there we go. Sinestro, Trix or Drix or whatever her name is. And Catwoman, Strix. Now, a lot of people say, oh, Superman's a villain. There was a DC storyline, which I am kind of interested in reading, in which these three very powerful villains from the future go back in time and, and basically alters Batman's and Superman's origin story to make them villains. They're in this set, so maybe I get them. Okay, this is interesting. Now, the funny thing is, was it about four months ago, the last DC set, Batman Team Up, came out, which had a lot of good villains. Now, this one. So, we got Bizarro. Riddler Goon. Omac, Killer Croc, and a Harley Quinn. Okay, this is now, this is kind of interesting. We got another Superman right here, Captain Cold. Look at this, this is warped. White Rabbit Goon, a Starfight, a Toy Man, or Starfight. Hmm. Oh, also, before I go any further, I also picked up the, the new starter sets that came out. I also picked up a copy of the new starter set. I will be doing a video of that, you know, very soon. So, and that'll be, that's a future video coming up. Kind of want to see what these, they're, so nine times out of ten, they got away from the big, humongous starter sets that I've been buying for a, for a while. And this seems to be a little bit, ooh, another bag. Okay, first one here is Riddler. Black Manta Goon. And this is one of those powerful people that turned Superman and Batman evil. Uh, Lightning Lad, Lightning Lord. And we got a League of Assassin. A League Assassin. And in the bubble wrap. Rachel Ghoul. Oh, 
four more, four more boosters left. Jesus. Hate to see it, but you know, it happens. Okay, we got a bear, polar bear goon, mirror master, another bizarro scarecrow, and a black addle broken off of his base so I got now I gotta glue him I gotta glue him now the thing is one thing about it they do have a good replacement system but it takes a long time for you to get something replaced um was it about a year or two ago when the house of X set came out and what am I um Chase figures didn't have a card, so I had to get a replacement. It took them, it, I mean, they replaced it, but it took them like a long time to do it. Okay, this is interesting. Got another baggie. We got Jokester, another Harley Quinn, Solomon Grundy, and a Gorilla Soldier, Gorilla City Warrior. And in the bag, I think I have the kick-ass version of Poison Ivy. Hmm. Okay. The put did I didn't even buy the play at home kit this time because the play at home kit is poison ivy. And the thing is is that it's nice to have the play at home kit. It's a nice gesture, but the thing is is that, you know, once ever since they gave us those uh cardboard tiles, I don't like the idea of paper tiles anymore. Because you have to try to get them, keep them straight and all this other stuff. All right. Well, we're down to the second to the last booster. All right. Interesting. All right. Very good. Very good. All right, got Batman, which is one of the characters I wanted. Cosmic King, which is the second of the three villains of that one storyline. Talon. Is it Talon? Oh, Portofile Assassin. Sly Borgman and Frank the Plant. Sly Borgman, oh, uh, well, okay, cool. Here we are at the last booster. I picked these up at what my uh, one of my gaming store, R R R I W Games, and the funny thing is, is that in the next couple of days they're gonna have a this is their 25th anniversary. They've been around for 25 years, and it, which is a good feat for it's a very good feat for a store like that. Very good feat. Pretty nice. Pretty good feat for a store to last that long. And it has the... Then again, you know... What pretty much keeps that store open is Magic the Gathering. Because they always have an event 
they have an event there almost every week for Magic the Gathering. And plus, Pokemon, they still have events for Pokemon. Not much for anything else, but that's fine. We got Batman again. We got this Warps plastic. We got General Zod, which is cool. Scarecrow. Deadshot. And Grodd. Okay, so there was an ultra chase of all three of these villains, Zod and you know three th from the Superman movie. That was an ultra chase, which I knew I wasn't going to get, but it would be nice to have. Um, I kind of need a little bit more goons per se to make that mechanic really work very well. Mm. I'm pretty sure there's some other stuff. Now, the funny thing is the next set that comes out is Ghost Rider, and that's going to be pretty soon. I mean, it's like they're just dropping sets left and right, plus the Iconics. I'm still on the I'm still on the lookout for the Iconics Su Death of Superman set. Still on the lookout for that one. That one is a good-looking set. Oh... Okay, so let me time to open this legacy card. Did I get what I was looking for? Knowing my luck, the answer is no. And true to my true to form, I got hush. Now I don't have this set, I don't have this figure at all. And this figure, this figure comes to 2012 Batman set. I was looking for the uh, uh, Dark Side Legacy card because I actually have that Dark Side figure clicks. So that's what I was. That was the one I was hoping for. And of course, I didn't get it. So if I buy another, you know, I can, I'm just on the lookout for it. Now, personally, I'm not really planning on buying another brick of this. I'm not really planning on doing that. But if, you know, the winds blow the right way, I might end up doing that. Who knows? But other than that, that's it for this new Hero Click set. The next Hero Click set I'm going to do something with is I'm going to unbox this new starter set to see what it looks like. Now, the thing is, this right here is very, very small and very compact, which is great. So I have a feeling that these are the sculpts that's in it. So that's cool. I like that Spider-Man, of course. But, you know, and then we'll see. Then we'll see what happens. And with that being said, I hope you liked the video. If you're a good, if you're a HeroClick fan like I am, you know, if you got, if you collect, let me know what you dropped, let me know what you picked up. Um, other than that, uh, yeah, I'm still trying to work on doing some gameplay videos. I'm still trying to do that and still haven't done it yet. But anyway, other than that, thanks very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.